Hello and welcome back to my video and today I am going to be reading a story that I made. It took me ages, literally ages it took me. I can't believe how, took it, how long it took. I got so annoyed. It's a two page story. This is all I wrote. Okay, let's start. It's called Dragon and Me. Okay, so yeah. Um, I don't know why I'm waiting. So yeah. There is a boy. Leave a like on this video and subscribe. Hope you enjoyed the story. And this video. There is a boy who lives in a village. The village is small, but the boy didn't care. There is a protector with 2,000 men army armed with axes and shield shields yeah it was a wonderful life till one day a tornado came but that was not a tornado it was a mythical dragon very rare but but everyone who sees it dies the two thousand men ar army marched towards the dragon but everyone died in battle the villagers ran to the boats to evacuate, but when they headed to the sea, the dragon destroyed the boats and everyone drowned, but the boy grabbed to a, onto a spare raft and fell asleep. Hmm. The next day, he woke up in a village, and it was a much bigger village. It wasn't just a village, it was a town. The boy had burns all over his body from the mythical dragon and shouted for help. To make matters worse, he fainted. When he woke up, he found himself in a hospital, wrapped up in, his, in, in bandages. He was next to a man that asked him. He doesn't recognise him. The boy told what happened, but what, <clears throat> what he didn't realise that there was 20 people were around him, so he is doomed. I lost my page. Oh, yeah. uh -huh. the, boy name, the boy's name is Joe. I don't know why I said, said that right now. And, <clears throat> and he was here to avenge his parents, blah, blah, blah. And when he was... Better, he asked to train him to be an army man to protect the town. And the years passed, he, he grew up and better at fighting. He went on hundreds of missions and success and succeeded. I can't say that word, my boy. I don't know if you can hear that, but that's my sister's Alexa in the next room. The next mission he was on was to slay a dragon. When he got to the cave and went inside, he saw the dragon. It had an arrow through his foot. The man who was the boy, so Joe, took the arrow out of the, out of the dragon's leg. It, but it woke up. The dragon didn't attack it. Didn't attack Joe. It lost my page. Just wait a minute. Okay, I found it. The dragon didn't attack him. It wanted to be friends, but then a horn rang, which means there is an invasion. But with two million people with axes and shields, it can't be beat. But this was that miracle dragon, and they had to fight it. It was a terrible battle with Joe and his army down one to seven. Joe's army had seven people. How's that an army? And his army... Ah, what the... Seven people in it. 
one dropper and one dragon. But when Joe was flung into a house, it was over, or was it? I see, I hear boom. I don't know if you hear. Okay, let's just get back to story reading. Oh, I'm a Mr. Nerd. It was all over for him, um, the dr dragon, but then, the is it over or was it? The dragon that helped Joe, that helped, the dragon that Joe helped was fighting the mythical dragon. After seven hours of fighting, the mythical dragon died and the whole town was saved. Thanks. Yeah, saved. And that's the end. Okay. Um, hope you enjoyed that video. I hope you did actually. Leave a like and subscribe to this video. See you next time.